Lottis. Hi, I'm Valentina. Hello, guys. So, hello, guys, again today. This is Goreshi, as he says, and I have Valentina with me, and she's an awesome girl. You spelled my name fine. I'm so proud. <laughs> Likewise. So, how's your academics and social life going in Cambridge? Yeah. Very well. I'm a second year PhD student. Uh -huh. I'm writing the history of pre Islamic Arabia, which is uh, yeah. Yeah, a very interesting and specific topic. Uh -huh. And uh, I'm very active in college. I'm the yeah. president of the Bentley Society, Film Society, Daddy Poet Society. I'm a member of the CR because I'm part of the Finance Committee. Mm -hmm. um, and I'm also re representative of the college for the arts. Um, That's quite a lot. <laughs> I'm not even near. I'm in charge of decoration <laughs> for the Mayball. Yeah, nice. I wrote and acted in the pantomime. This, uh, oh yes, it which was... is a big deal for college. You guys have to be involved with the pantomime. It's the best. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. So why Cambridge? Why, why not any other university in the world? Why well, Cambridge? first of all, Cambridge is Cambridge, right? So it's one of the best universities in the world. Uh, yeah. The world, absolutely. Uh -huh. uh, then my supervisor is here, and uh, while working on a PhD, your supervisor is fundamental. Yeah. And you have to respect mm -hmm. him, but get along with him very yeah. well. And I am the best supervisor in the world. That's, that's great. <laughs> yeah. yeah. So what's your background? What did you do undergrad? What do you really do? So um, I did my undergrad in uh, Catania. Uh-huh. South Italy, Which is in uh, Italy. Yeah. So I did my undergrad there in uh, Near Middle Eastern Studies. Mm -hmm. And then I moved to Naples for my MA. Mm. And I did Oriental languages and cultures. So wow. pretty much the same thing. Mm. Um, during my BA, I studied Arabic mm. and Hebrew. And mm. I did the same for my MA. Mm. And my last year of the MA was in London at yeah. SOAS. Yeah. Um, then I took a course at Oxford. And um, then I arrived here. Nice. Uh, what research did you do before applying to Cambridge? Well, uh, you mean like in the application process? In the application process, yes. yes. Oh, which course and how, how does it Well, I always work? knew I wanted to do a PhD. So I started looking for possible supervisors. Mm -hmm. And I actually applied to five different universities in uh, the UK. Uh -huh. um, I was lucky, like, and I got accepted to all of them. Nice. And, uh, nice. Yeah, nice. exactly. That's and then I chose, again, um, considering the supervisors that yeah. yeah. Because that's definitely the most important part. And also, um, my research is connected with late antiquity, hmm. and there is a great late antiquity in that world. College. Mm. So, did you choose this college as part of the application? No, I didn't choose this college. I didn't choose any college. Any college. It was an open application, same as me. Yeah. So yeah. we were given the same as college. Yeah, I wanted it to be. I know it's very romantic, but I wanted it to be the college choosing me, a bit of Harry Potter style. Ah. Uh, so I didn't choose it, also easy, because yeah. I didn't, uh, I mean it was my first time in Cambridge, yeah. so never been here, I don't know anything about the places. Yeah. And you may end up in a very rich and beautiful college like King's, but you, you may not like the vibe of the but college. Or the stay and the exactly. yeah. They might be beautiful outside, I'm not saying it's not, like they're so pretty, Freddie, John's, King's, yeah. etc. But yeah, it all comes down to the people who exactly. you have to live with, who you flourish along I mean, this your is degree your course. House. This, this is your home. house, yes. You spend like so, 16 to 16 hours, approximately exactly. 8 hours in the department, 16 hours in college. Which well, is I spend uh, my entire day in college oh, because yeah. I study in a room. So I just go down for a big lunch and then oh, go nice. back and then go down yeah, and like, yeah. I live here. Uh -huh. And this is my family. And uh, yeah. this is uh, a very nice college mm -hmm. because it's uh, the most international one. Mm. So I get to meet people from all around the world, which is mm. extraordinary, not just because you get to try food yeah. from all around the world, <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. but also yeah. because if you plan a trip abroad, abroad, you always have a friend that can ask you. So yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> whatever you, you go. Like, where, this is kind of where you have a friend yeah, and you learn belonging to from that country. From other people. Of yes, course. yes. And, um, and you didn't visit Cambridge before coming mm, in? Well, I came for meeting my supervisor, but was like, one day trip mm -hmm. and uh, mm -hmm. I went to my faculty and my team and then came back home. So. Mm -hmm. Nice. Yeah. Okay, and how would you quote expectation of Cambridge versus reality? And uh, are you in third year? What do you say? Well, I was expecting Cambridge to be posh, unaccessible, yeah. um, really scary. <laughs> <laughs> And actually, uh, uh, it is for some aspects, mm -hmm. but uh, I think the college makes uh, 
if you are in a college that makes you feel comfortable, mm -hmm. all of these disappear. Yeah. Like as soon as I entered at St. Edmunds, I felt at home. I felt accepted. I didn't have to worry about my really strong Italian accent, yeah. Sicilian accent. And um, I felt at home. So uh -huh. I think the college is a really important part of your Cambridge uh -huh. adventure. Let's, yeah. if you, you just said society, let's talk a bit of society as well. Yeah. You read us for Valentina's academic life. So, uh, you serve as uh, so many like painting yeah. society, the the East Coast society, and do you want to brief a bit like what you do as a role yeah. and how yeah, you absolutely. involve people? Absolutely. So the Dedicated Society is the oldest because mm -hmm. it was active also last year. Yeah. And it's actually a Cambridge University society uh -huh. registered with the Cambridge University yeah. society. Mm -hmm. And um, we meet uh, once a month, mm -hmm. and we have a team. Each session has a team, and yeah. uh, we bring forms uh, from all around the world, nice. which is also again very nice thing. Very nice. Yeah, we so yeah, get to know. Yeah, you get to artists. hear yeah. a form yeah. from a Mexican author, from an Italian, from a Swedish, and it's. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah, it's very interesting. Uh -huh. nice. And uh, we meet over wine and cheese, which uh -huh. is classy and nice. Yeah. And uh, <laughs> I love in cheese. the Okinaga room, which I don't know if you show. If you show um, to maybe I'll give a glance in the next video. Okay, yeah. because it's a very beautiful. It's beautiful. Room it's the have. highest, uh, they have a, the tower is the exactly. highest amongst our areas. And you get really good views of the whole city of Cambridge yeah. from the Okinawa Tower. Yeah, it's super yeah. good. Mm -hmm. so, Maybe I'll put this on when I tour the whole Edmonds College. and you, we can, you can see Valentina again in the tour. Yeah, you should, yeah. absolutely. So, so, what about the painting society? Do you have any aim yeah. of so, displaying the genre? Yeah, of absolutely. So, the painting society was created this year. Yeah. Um, I painted it. Yeah, and it's super good. <laughs> super good. Um, yeah, so it was created this year because we are renovating this year. Yeah. And uh, I thought, oh, we need some paintings to also add some color because we painted everything in white and. You know, so that's a good idea rather than buying from the market. Let's yeah. all use the talent of I mean, all this year is made by the college by for the students. students. It's actually made by okay. the students. Well, as a whole, well as a whole the college is the students so yeah. for me. I don't like the separation of college, the staff, the students. It's all together. Yeah. Um, mm -hmm. So the Petri Society uh, aims to. Showcase all the talent, yeah. The, exactly, showcase the talent of the students and make them feel at home. Yeah, like <laughs> what university has taught you about work, like management of time? Oh, okay, okay, yeah. okay. Well, uh, first of all, being a PhD student, I have to organize myself. Yeah. I don't have a schedule unless I decide my schedule. Yes, yeah. And yeah. I. So that's the beauty of PhD, you are flexible. Yeah, to it's all a beauty, but it's also very challenging. <laughs> you know, some days you just wake up and think, oh, it's a beautiful day. Why don't they go out and just walk for yeah. hours and mm -hmm. you cannot, you know? Mm -hmm. And also a big problem is trying to give yourself time to uh -huh. stop uh -huh. and distress and yeah. just yeah. do the things you want to do because, yeah. you know, it's Saturday and maybe, you know, it's afternoon uh -huh. and you think, oh wait, I should uh, study and then, uh, you know. Or you end up meeting friends, maybe. Yeah, you end up meeting <laughs> friends, and that's totally right, because, you know, it's Saturday after all, so most of the people in the world don't work on Saturday, yeah, so, yeah. I mean, you should find time for also... The balance. Yeah, the to balance between these, yeah. and I think the society uh, and the college life are me a lot with that. Mm -hmm. uh, because, for example, when I meet with the film society, which mm -hmm. is usually on a Wednesday at 9, mm -hmm. with uh, some snacks, uh, something to drink, that's but it's the moment... Really, really uh, yeah. On lit, like it's it's really on fire. Yeah, yeah. Like it's really yeah, good. and I and I feel like oh, it's totally deserved. You know, <laughs> I, I need a break. Yeah, I need a break. Of course, yeah. yeah, yeah. That's the big uh, the biggest challenge. Okay. So Saint okay. Edmunds is a mature college. Do you regret coming to a mature college or any good aspect of the like one good aspect of the college? Well, I'm very happy of being yeah, in this college so because. Yeah. Uh, I'm old, no, I'm not that old, uh, but I'm 26, so I must say I feel comfortable being around people mm. of my age. Mm. You know, the gap when you are 18 you know, and 26, and you, actually, you, people. That, you that's feel right. it, yeah. you know, you feel it. Yeah. So I'm happy that actually I'm in this college that is yeah, yeah, and also exactly. for the noise, let's face yeah. it, you know, like undergrad is like to party every day, every yeah, night, yeah, yeah. and I like to party too, a lot, but like, by time to work, Tuesday night, yeah, uh, I have to submit a paper, mm. I need time, I need silence, mm. I need time, I need silence, yeah, yeah, you know? Yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> yeah. And, okay, that's going to be a happy question. If you're given an enormous amount of financial and political power yeah. in this college, yeah. name one thing you want to change. Oh, that's or maybe, a very hard one. Yeah, maybe you want to add or contribute something that, oh, Valentina has 
Yeah, the same just because because of your power, you know. Yeah. What would you like to? Do? Well, I think the biggest thing that would change is the interior design of the game. Interior design, that's so artistic. <laughs> Which is actually okay. what I'm already doing because okay. I'm uh, helping with the CR yeah. uh, department. Yeah. And I just saw them in curtains, which are light blue and That's blue. nice, yeah. And so I think it will work a lot on the design. We will put more patties, absolutely. That that shows how artistic and she's like a creative <laughs> person. Okay, yeah. Yeah, yeah, absolutely. That's nice. I will okay. work on that because I mean the support from the general office is, hmm. is great. It's great, okay. Thank and the food exactly. is great too. Yeah, food. I will not great. change the yeah. food, yeah. absolutely. Yeah. Mm -hmm. I love our parties. Our parties the are box. Fun. Yeah. Maybe I will make this year slightly bigger because of that space. Too common, yeah. Because everyone loves it, so all people from other colleges they yeah. wanna come and attend. Yeah, we're, we're probably part. one of the best uh, colleges. Party for, tour colleges, yeah. Absolutely. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> That's or, why the main ball is gonna be amazing. Amazing, you know? of course. Yeah. And okay, the last question of this challenge, thank you very much. Any one good tip you want to give to forthcoming people who, who chose the same as one or who are coming and joining us next academic year? Well, you some, any tip you want to give them? Well, maybe related accommodation, yeah. academic life, social life, like what are Well, you accommodation is actually a big thing that we should discuss, I think, because there are different kind of accommodations in college. Mm -hmm. Yeah. And you want to know which one you're going to get before. Mm -hmm. So I think that the important thing is to start ahead. Of planning with accommodation, trying yeah. to see what are the options, yeah. the rent, yeah. and so on. And well, feel free to contact me. Can I say this? Yeah, of course. I'll put her CSID email. Yeah, I'll make it to answer her. Can, yeah, and she's like, you can contact her. Yeah. I guess I'll link up the Facebook as well, Valentina. Yeah, yeah, and the uh, email ID so you can contact her and have, yeah, yeah I'm get along. Come to Brandy. Any questions? Me, Valentina. I was also Mar very active at Freshers Week. Oh, so yes. I was the face. Uh, that's that's a big help. That's you. a big help. Yes. Mm -hmm. And probably yeah. next year too. So whoever comes next year will meet me as soon as the case. Sure, year, sure. Which sure. is intimidating. No, yeah. so. <laughs> <laughs> so here we are, like helping all our uh, in newcoming students. Yeah, I was on that side. Yeah. Uh, you know, not so long ago. Yeah, yeah, I'm second year. year yeah. So I know, know and I was pressure. living at Swiss Scott, which next year is not going to be part of part the college. We are building a new mosque at the But it's uh, far away. Uh, you know? So what's going to really far away? So mm -hmm. the yes. new student that you don't have to worry about. We have new accommodation. So all the students all have been have new accommodation inside on Yeah. And um, that's great. That's great. Yes. Thank you, Valentina, for your time. And it was so great. Thank you. Thank you.